Oh god. Yeah, this was the right thing to watch. Like my backstory. If you're a pothead, watch Brandon Rogers. Does that look better there? Yeah. What's clapping my clappers? All right, you know, it's been a while since I checked out some Brandon Rogers. Actually, a long ass time. Pretty sure I reacted to his entire Sam and Me series, but I'm not too sure if I ever uploaded all of them. Like, I may still have the footage from that last Brandon Rogers. Shoot, I'm not even too sure, so what the hell am I even talking about? That actually, it might all be posted, but regardless, I always mention this, but since this is my first time reacting to Brandon Rogers on this particular channel, thought I'd mention it <laughs> again, but he actually commented on one of my reactions to him. That's right, if you go to my old channel, Shadow Productions, look up his videos, it was the Western one I reacted to, he left a freaking comment! It's like, I'll have to smoke a full few bowls with you, man. And, uh... Yeah, man. Wait, I wonder if I could have actually DM'd him. Cause, oh shit, did I miss my shot? Oh my God, you know, you see these big YouTubers as like holier than thou and you don't want to be a stalker, but like, could I have actually have reached out to him? Oh my God. All right, let's. <laughs> I'm for, uh, for real, like, just not realizing that. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, let's, um, adult arcade commercial. Love his humor, and he said I, I gave a great reaction that one time. Oh my god. <laughs> Howdy, you ugly turd squeezers! My name's Lux, and I love Play video games. Which is why I'm opening up Luxie Leroy's Lucky Ass Adult Big Ass. I love to play video games. Man! And you may know me from <laughs> such advertisements as Luxie Leroy's Pre owned Ass Holder. Pre owned Sex Toys. Sticks for pushing away kids. Sunglasses for perverts. <laughs> they don't need to know where your eyes want to go. And now I'm trying to get your broke ass to come on. Specifically per for perverts. We let you have intercourse on top of any one of these machines. Except these damn claw grabbers. Which are fat phobically made of glass. You like running? <laughs> then go ahead and take that shit to Dave and Buster's. We got trash cans. Beer cans. Garbage cans with beer cans and a can-do attitude can i get a refund no, i think i can they need <laughs> more arcades with beer easy to find and so is adults it. only for the greatest prizes from around wait these might be real or maybe they're not brandon rogers these... mobile game without all the efforts of having to go to that fucking <laughs> app store but it is my ipad so i will be monitoring you while you play hurry up is this making fun of real adult or alt arcades or is that not really a thing I've chosen a life of greed! You know, I used to come to this very arcade back when I was a little Lux. I used to steal tickets from all the other little kids. Not many witnesses, though, at least not no more. Rule number three to being a great salesman. Come here. You could sell what you stole and you could steal back what you sold. And over here you'll find our slightly illegal gambling section. <laughs> Hold on, that's weird. We've already been to the prize room. I'll tell you what, with over 20,000 machines, this place could be a little easy to get a little lost. I think we're going in circles. Dude, I think we need to stop filming this getting serious. No, the only thing that's serious <laughs> is the low price of admission. Are you gonna, <laughs> gonna keep filming? They do make like a man, or are you gonna be the first to get eaten? <laughs> casinos purposely disorganizing. Arcades are like casinos. I worked at a casino. <laughs> it was like a maze. What? <laughs> No windows. Due to being a great salesman, always make the right choices. <laughs> And that choice is about as dumb as my price ad. Yeah, that was not. He's so much funnier than me. I would have just said that is not the right choice. But he took it to a whole other thing. <sighs> he got me. Ah! Remember! Yes, remember that Saturdays are 50% off. Remember! Ah! <laughs> Dude, oh, God. Yeah, this was the right thing to watch. Like my backstory. If you're a pothead, watch Brandon Rogers. Does that look better there? Yeah. Whoa, this thing's spitting out tickets like the dickhead! Cool! You wanna split them 50 50? How about we split them 150? 
fifty, and I'm the hundred. But you wouldn't even know what to do with that many tickets. I'm gonna <laughs> sell them for money, and then I'm gonna take that money and buy something else, and then sell that, and then buy more things, and then sell those, and buy and sell and sell, sell, sell till I'm the greatest salesman who ever lived. <laughs> I hate capitalism. <laughs> And so is a job. Please don't steal them tickets. It's like Christmas past. Dan, this is the moment that changed everything. Is that fat kid? Is that big child guy person? The clown? Enough. And it could be yours. For the this price. video is sponsored because here in America, <laughs> more is better. A life. Oh. Of never being enough. Dude. It's Dude. not too late to change, what kiddo. Happened? You don't want to grow up to be me. That boy. That boy was you. I've been stuck in this arcade for decades because of you. And now I will have my revenge and feast on your corpse. But first, why don't you go ahead and feast on these? The tickets. You didn't sell them. Then how did you become the world's greatest salesman? Yeah. By selling my soul instead. And that takes us to rule number one of being a great salesman. Why cut prices when you can cut a witness? So come on down to Luxy, Lucky, Adult, Big Ass, Labia, whatever the fuck this place is called. I was a little worried the cord was going to get disconnected when that happened, but I, 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 saw, I saw it. Merchandise Emporium. Your body is not ready for all this neato bullshit. I thought my body would not be ready for this Helen face mask. Turns out, <laughs> the face mask was not- Hey, is this real? These blame joint papers are a great gift for stoners. <gasps> if they got a penis, they now got a boner. Try impeaching these, motherfucker! Hey. Give her had sex, save yourself some time, and buy this bullshit. It's just as nice, unless it's anal. <laughs> yeah, genius as usual. Why, why don't I react to more Brandon Rogers? Doesn't make any sense. Okay, I'm gonna start reacting to him. And not only that, I'm going to react to his other stuff that I haven't seen, get caught up on that, eventually. I'm also going to do that for other artists, but he's definitely at the top of the list. Near the top. Might be at the top. A pandemic is literally the worst time to be burning bowls with anyone. I probably did miss my chance, didn't I? <laughs> You're not watching anymore, are you? You're far too big. No, he was famous at the time, too. Oh my god, I'm just going <laughs> to... I should be having this conversation with myself after the video, not during the actual video. No, but we seriously just watched another piece of brilliant, what would you call this? Cinema? I'm not, not cinema. I will just call it art. It is art. Video. YouTube video. I love the comedy. I feel like it's, it's getting to a much weirder place than I remember it. Or maybe it's just because his each, each video has its, does its own thing. But this one, <laughs> I thought was a lot weirder than other videos by him I've seen. The fact that it started off as an arcade commercial and then became uh, this movie about a guy trapped in his own arcade. And then we got that whole backstory and <laughs> him regretting his life's decisions. Like that whole intense kind of serious moment that actually got me because I'm easy to get <laughs> in the midst of all of this like... Ah, uh, humor. Yeah, brilliant. I really like it when they turn ser uh, silly things serious. That's probably my favorite kind of comedy, actually. <laughs> uh, yeah, thumbs up. Got a kick out of it. And if you got a kick out of me getting a kick out of this, be sure to hit that like and sub button if you haven't already. And odds are, you'll probably also get a kick out of that. I'm Snoopaloo. Thanks for stopping by, America. And Canada, everywhere, everywhere else too.